And finally tonight, a question, have you ever had an idea for a new gadget? Unfortunately not, but some middle school students in Nassau County did. So today they learned how to make their invention a reality. Things that kind of drive me crazy is where I come up with my ideas. For example, the balloon band a wristband for children that you can tie a balloon to so it doesn't fly away. For the last five years, inventor Brian Freed has been working to bring about a dozen products like this one to the market. Today, he talked to technology students at Manhasset Middle School about how to bring their ideas to life. Write it down and take action. You got to take action. If it's just sitting there and you don't do anything with it, you're going to be doing what everybody else says is give you the nudge and say, I thought of that, now look at where it is. Why didn't you think of that? But now it's up to the students. They have to come up with their own inventions and present it to the class in December. As we get older, we get comfortable. They're, they're learning things and they're very motivated to show their creativity. And my dream is not only do they walk out with a diploma as a high school student, they have a, a patent in the other hand. And students say they're ready to put their thinking caps on and become the next generation of great inventors. What is the spell? And who's going to do it? We are! Yeah! In Manhasset, Christina Renault, TV 10 and 55 News. David's got a great idea. I had an idea years ago of a reverse microwave, something that would chill something as quickly as you heat it up in a microwave, called a fridge wave but I think it's already been in. I it's think cool. you're a little late on that idea. Okay, forget it. <laughs> All right, thank you for joining us here tonight for the News at 11. I'm Michelle Imperato. And I'm Richard Rose. Thank you for being there. Inside Edition's next. Good night.